No worries, Ma. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Blog Era Jeopardy. Whew. Give yeah. it up. Woo. Give it up. With the most low key <laughs> creator of You Heard That New.com. I linked every song that you ever heard during the blog era. Here are my contestants. <laughs> First up, this man is a troublemaker. <laughs> Eric Rosenthal got his start. Hold on, let me. Yeah, 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 got yeah, his yeah. start <laughs> by following Kanye as a videographer at the 2005 Grammy Awards. Please, everybody, welcome Eric Rosenthal. Yeah. <laughs> My God, that's my God. <laughs> he pushed the locks. He came surprisingly anti Semitic after that. Yeah, yes, yes. So, yeah, coincidence? That, that, he pushed the not. locks in the locks. Man, I hope he locks it up today. <laughs> it's Jeff Rosenthal right yeah. now. Yeah. I don't think this man needs any introduction. He doesn't give it to him. <laughs> so, I'm gonna just, so he does. Just move on. I'm going to just move on. This is my guy, Rory, right here. Please give it up, give it up, give it up. Yeah. Man. Keeping the Slow Bucks brand alive. Yeah. And I got to read this verbatim for this man right here. The blog era was a direct response to his family creating an unattainable financial lifestyle. It's more. Yeah. Right Yo, who wrote that? <laughs> who wrote that? Don't look at me. Now, clearly you guys have played Jeopardy before, right? Of course. Yes. Yeah. All right. So you got your categories. We have that piff, lyrics, albums, mixtapes, and fits. And by fits, I mean you're going to look at the person, blur it out face, and pick to see who it is. All right? Okay. All right. Now, are y'all ready? Yes. Did y'all study? No. 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 Cool. No. That's yeah. what I want to hear. Absolutely not. So how do we none decide who goes case. first? How do we decide who goes first? I think it was just Jeff. Yeah, Jeff. Just Jeff? Jeff. Yeah, yeah, we landed with Jeff. Okay, Jeff, please pick a category. Let's do mixtapes for 100. Mixtapes for 100. Hello, <laughs> Trebek. Yeah. Okay. Name three of the original beats that Lil Wayne whapped over on No Ceilings. Rory. Uh, ice Cream Paint Job. Mm -hmm. Run This Town. Okay. Swag Surf. Wow. Let's Man. fucking go. Wow. Let's fucking go. <laughs> He is correct. Wow. Jesus Christ. I told you white people love hip hop. <laughs> <laughs> um, Study this shit. That was really Roy, good. <laughs> let's go again. Where you, uh, where you picking? Uh, let's go albums for 100. Albums for 100. What do we have here? Name three items on the cover of Kendrick Lamar's Section 80 LP. Oh, shit. Uh, ammo from a machine gun. Uh, fuck. There's some type of book. And mm, maybe a table. <laughs> that is an item. Wow. <laughs> technically, he is correct. Wow. Rory is two for two. Rory. What do you mean, technically? I mean, well, yeah. There was a table, right? Yeah, it was a table. That's yeah. an item. That's okay. an, it is, right. It's an item. That was shaky, but I. Right. Have you guys <laughs> talked before this? I don't think they have. <laughs> Rory, uh, let's 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 you go heard that new Rory Mall. <laughs> um, <laughs> let's go, let's go nuts. Let's go Dat Piff for three hundred. Dat oh, Piff for three hundred. God damn. What year was it founded? What Dat Piff? Dat Piff. Two thousand five. Stole the thunder. Wow. <laughs> three hundred. <laughs> I thought y'all was asking where your Piff was founded. I'm like, hey, oh, all right. It's been around yeah. forever. Yeah. yeah, that is in a different space. Yeah, my bad, my bad. Uh, uh, Jeff, let's pick it up. Uh, where you want to go? Dad Piff for 100. Hey, Dad Piff for 100. Right. What was the catchphrase said at the beginning of a song of an exclusive from Dad Piff? Ah, oh, fuck. What was that exclusive drop said before the song when it was released on Dad Piff? Eric, you heard that new.com. <laughs> no. Wrong. <laughs> that piff, motherfucker. <laughs> Close with no cigar. Let's reveal I that answer. I think we should give him the points. <laughs> <laughs> Let's reveal that answer, please. That uh, piff.com world. I swear I was going to say world premiere. <laughs> I swear I was going to say it. Um, all right. Let's see. Uh, Jeff, you had the last one. Um, yep. That piff again. for two. That piff for 200. Run the board. This artist released his solo debut mixtape on Dat Piff. What fashion brand was the title of the mixtape? Are y'all fucking serious? Mixtape on Dat Piff. Do you want me to answer the question? I, I, I would love that. Oh. Okay. Go ahead. True Religion. And another one from Jeff Rosenthal. 
thought there was going to be a picture. I was yeah. like, this artist. There's definitely an LRG mixtape that <laughs> yeah. came out before <laughs> fucking Trilogy. Uh, Jeff, you're on a roll right now. Let's uh, see, let's see what for got. four. Okay. Wow. What is the most downloaded mixtape on datpimp.com? Uh, Little Wayne, No Ceilings. No. Oh. Wiz Plea for Cushion OJ. No. <laughs> Meek Mill, uh, Dream Chasers. No. <laughs> Might as well just try yeah. it. Justin Bieber Journals. <laughs> no one got it. Let's reveal that answer real quick. I mean, oh. Dream Chasers 2. <laughs> so, Dream Chasers Wait, two, did you say? 4. I said Dream Chasers. <laughs> Jeff said Dream Chasers. I yeah. you said three. No, I, I said, said one. one. Oh, you, you're both wrong. Yeah. All right. yeah. <laughs> uh, Jeff, I guess we're going to stick with you, man. You're running the board. Uh, Dad Piff for five. Wait, how am I at minus 200? <laughs> Which artist has three spots in the top 10 most downloaded mixtapes? <laughs> Give it to them all. Give it to them all. Come on, please. please. Uh, Meek Mill. Wayne? Rory, finally. Wow. Is able to put some points on the board. Oh, I am positive now. All right. Now, Rory, uh, negative nine. <laughs> lyrics <laughs> and albums aren't really being touched. Fitz has not been touched at all, so I want to see if someone's brave enough to lean into that category. I don't like how the host is like, you know, giving I'm trying his to mix it up a little bit. That's all <laughs> yeah, I'm trying I don't to remember do. Alex Trebek ever saying anything <laughs> yeah. but yes or no. Um, <laughs> lyrics, I know I'm going to fuck up, so let's go Fitz for 100. Okay, Fitz for 100. Who was that? <laughs> Literally anybody. <laughs> Who was that? <laughs> the hand is giving Drake, but I don't. It's I, I didn't. giving. <laughs> <laughs> this is like Celebrity Jeopardy. Like it's just all in the negative. <laughs> this is not gonna be a fun. J Cole, just going with there it. There we go. Oh, there there we go. J Cole. Yes. Rory is on a roll. Caesar J Cole fits for two hundred. Let's go. Yeah, Let's okay, keep okay. it going. All right, all right. right. Who is that? Oh no. <laughs> Mo. Big Sean. Yeah, yeah. Mo. Yeah. <laughs> Big Sean. You you the, you're the next category, so you pick wherever you want to go. Uh, let's do Fitz for three hundred. Who's that? B O B. <laughs> what? Why do y'all think B O B is light skin? <laughs> Kid Cudi. Y'all blind? Is it, this? I was going to say Russell it's, Westbrook. It's but. very blurry, <laughs> yeah. right in the important part. Drake? Thank you. Let's go. go. Let's go. <laughs> so y'all should Only Drake will wear that nasty V-neck. <laughs> Yo, by the way, thanks for paying for the picture. <laughs> <laughs> Roy, where do you want to take it on the board, man? Fits for 400. You staying in the fits. Staying in that pocket. Okay. Who is that? Cool Kids. Yeah? Wow. Let's fucking go. Rory is on his shit. He was all nice studying. I like this energy. What, what did I study? Man, how the, fuck, how the fuck he know that, man? <laughs> what? I'm not rolling. Nah, I'm not rolling. This is an insubordination. <laughs> yeah. Is there any other groups in the blog era? Not yes. really. I'm yes, yeah, there's there's yeah. so many. Yeah. Not good. Like, there's yeah. a layer. There's a lot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There's a lot of groups. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> for five minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Let's keep it in the fix. Buzz up. Rory. <laughs> Asher? I, I there it is, Asher. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Rory the Asher, the same on. shit. Just, that just screams I love college. <laughs> uh, where do you want to take it on the board? I'm going to do lyrics for... Oh, my God. Uh-oh. Now this is when it gets tricky. Yeah, I'm going to lose all my points. <laughs> yeah, right. Here we go. For five. Wow. Lyrics for 500. Like okay. All right. What Bill Murray movie does Mac Miller sample It Just Doesn't Matter on his Faces mixtape? I want to beat Rory. Space Jam. Ooh, that is a Bill Murray movie, I guess. <laughs> that is a sick movie. We're going to pass on this question. <laughs> no, we didn't pass. We all lost. Meatballs. Too true. Wow. <laughs> all right. Lyrics yeah. for one. Lyrics for 100 for my man Jeff. Finish this lyric. Dang, 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 skeet, skeet, skeet. Ah, skeet, 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 skeet. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, leading it to the ah is crazy. Ah, skeet, 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 skeet. skeet, skeet, skeet. <laughs> no. Uh, who picked this? Julian. Yeah. Right. Come on now. This is definitely one of Julian's favorite songs. <laughs> Who's in lyrics? Uh, me, 200. Right. Let's go to 200 for lyrics. 
Mm-hmm. And I've been signed to Ye for well over a year now. It's clear now I'm going to focus on my career now. Who the fuck fit? said that? Who said this? Big Sean. There we go. Yeah. Rory's on the board That's again. I do it. I was scared that was like a sci high. Yeah, or like designer. <laughs> <laughs> Did Alex Rebeck ever drink on Jeopardy? I don't know. No. He, well, he looked. Yeah. I mean, he had a problem. <laughs> <laughs> it caught up to him years later. <laughs> Thanks, Dick. Uh, oh, yeah, let's, go, uh, let's go Mixtapes 200. Name the one song from J. Cole's The Warm Up series that is also featured on his debut oh. album. Lights, please. Should. Damn. Yeah. No. <laughs> No. Lost one. No. You might as well. <laughs> Dollar in a dream. No. Jeff. Jeff. Can't get enough. No. <laughs> <laughs> Are y'all fucking serious? Like, seriously? <laughs> Anybody? In the morning? Hey. hey. <laughs> no, we should be clapping fact for that. Check, fact check. Fact check. the warm up and it's on. No, it's not. I don't, I don't care for these nah. questions. <laughs> no, I want my points. I'm I think, I think uh, work, me and Eric are correct. What, what are you doubting? Hold on. That was on, that was on Friday Night Lights. Yeah. The warm-up yeah. was before he even got yes. signed. He didn't get a drink yes. feature then. Yes. We all get 500. All yeah. of us get 500. Yeah. 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 I get 500 sh- points to everybody. What is in the game? Yes. I think that's only right that everyone <laughs> at the table, especially you, yeah. uh, gets 500 points. Yeah. All right. So everybody gets 500 for Julian's screw-up. Yeah, you are. All right. <laughs> because Maul is losing so much, I'm going to let him pick the topic. Yes. Right yeah, now. let's go. Do I it, Maul. I just want to get Do it, Maul. I'll die for this shit. Fuck him up, Maul. Uh, let's do albums for 500. Yeah. What? Oh, God, I hate this question. Go ahead. Wow. Well, I mean, say the question. Yeah, say what the question. holiday did ASAP Rocky's debut album, Love, Live Love ASAP, drop it, release on? When? Ar- Arbor Day. Who? Victory Over Japan Day. <laughs> Halloween. <laughs> Halloween. <laughs> there we go. Y'all don't take y'all y'all take nothing serious. Like <laughs> none of y'all take anything serious. He got it right. <laughs> he hit Good. the buzzer. Yeah. <laughs> pick it, uh, pick uh, albums for four. Albums for four hundred. Which artist inspired the skit at the end of the race on Wiz's Khalif Khalifa's debut album Rolling Papers? <laughs> Snoop Dogg. No. No, we already Amber, Amber Rose. Okay, now you're being petty. <laughs> <laughs> Now you're being petty. You're just being just being Kanye West. Okay. Yeah. Now you come on, like no one's gonna get this. Wiz Khalifa. No. It, it, <laughs> well, I mean, but yes. I think I think I think Rory gets it. No, reveal the answer, please. Well, that's a song. Remember, no, the skit. Remember, <laughs> okay. like wake yeah. up, get downstairs. Yeah. That's that. That's the skit. Okay. Nobody got it. <laughs> uh, uh, oh well, yeah, give me something else. Albums for three hundred. Who was? Uh, Play Pat. Who? <laughs> Was the main A&R on Kid Cudi's debut album, Man on the Moon. Eric. Play Pat. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Let's Bro, do this. mixtapes for 300, Mixtapes for 300. Which basketball player co-hosted Drake's <laughs> release party for so far? Go ahead, Maul. Chris Paul. <laughs> What give, the, the, Chris give me a... <laughs> okay, in Maul's defense, he was on one of the interludes. Which basketball player co-hosted Drake's release party? If you're wrong, I'll, I'll buzz it again. Okay. <laughs> go ahead. LeBron. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Maul, there are very few topics left. And Wait, I don't know if you have to all of them. There's, I'm at one now. There's still three. I gotta take these seriously. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Five topics, yeah. Five topics left. The comeback begins. Let's see a comeback series. Uh, let's go... Fuck it. Album's 200. I don't like Rory's stance right now. Name three of the female vocalists on Wale's debut album, Attention Deficit. This should be an easy one, especially for Rory since he loves R&B. Marsha Ambrose. That's not her name. I know, yeah. Am- Ambrose. All right. Am- Marsha Ambrosius. One half of Flow There you go. Mm-hmm. Rihanna, technically. That's a technical. See, that's a technicality. Uh, I don't care. No, so no, I'm not. That's not fine. One, I'm I'm hosting. <laughs> contemplate. Rihanna is singing on contemplate. That's contemplate is not fine. Two. No, that's so he no, lost. Can yeah, we just yeah, buzz yeah. him out? Yeah. So buzz if I turn out. on if I turn on contemplate by Wale right now, Rihanna wouldn't be singing on it. Well, it says three out of five. Yeah. Uh, 
Lady Gaga. Wow. There it is. Wow. I feel like he got that wrong. Yeah. I, I, did, I think so too. Also, there's two topics. Like, <laughs> no, I'm, forward. Mark this I'm, not, I'm not here to correct anybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not here to what make any noise. There's only two topics. Not four. Are you here to make friends? Oh, well, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Four. What? <laughs> We're fact checking right now. Hold on, ladies and gentlemen. If Julian got another one wrong, 500 for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> She's not featured on the album. <laughs> she's a vocalist. The question was not, vocals. She's not featured. She's Melanie sampled. Fiona. <laughs> so technically you're wrong. Lady Gaga. <laughs> Lady Gaga. This is bullshit. <laughs> and, uh, uh, uh um, Trump were you, were you not listening? No, Trump what, uh, Chris and Michelle? Yes. Wow, yeah. run it up. Wait, wow. he gets the points after you put the answer on the screen? <laughs> yes. This is, I'm telling you, this is this is a malarkey. <laughs> this is crazy. Run right. my points. All right, so you got your points. You got two categories. Wait, Jeff gets those points? Yes, he does. Yeah, yeah. yeah give me more points. I'm telling you, he read the answer off the screen. <laughs> and by the way, not very well. I was like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Jeff, give me some. Uh, some. Lyrics for three. Lyrics for 300. On um, which Gay Cole mixtape is this line from? If they don't know your dreams, then they can't shoot them down. Friday Night Lights? There we go. Hey. You want to fact check that too? Yeah. <laughs> we need to. Uh, mixtapes for 500. Woo. Mm -mm. Big Sean's Detroit has two. Why am I here if you're not going to listen? <laughs> Okay, I just I want to feel appreciated. Just let me just let me get it off. Big Sean's Detroit has two stories interludes. Name one artist that tells me. I can name more for extra points. Wow, it's only two. Young Jeezy. Young Jeezy. I can name more. It's only two. Young Jeezy, Common, Snoop Dogg. Uh, name an Chappelle. artist that tells one. Common Young Jeezy. Yes, you, yes, you get it. Yes. So as we uh, close this game out, let's give a score update. I need uh, a daily double. Rory's at, Rory's at 400. Where is the daily double? <laughs> yeah, those are done. Maul's at negative 1,800. Uh, I like to buy a vowel. Why are you putting my business out there? <laughs> well, it's on the screen. All right. All right. No. And, uh, 18, 1,800 is Lowe's favorite. 1,100 negative. And then what are you at? Yeah. I'm at a thousand. Huh? So okay, perfect so time to let you know sponsored 2, by 1800 2, Tequila. Yeah. Like every listening event in the blog That's era. Right. As we close this game out, let's run down the score and blog era Jeopardy. Let's do this. Rory is at 1100. Jeff is at a thousand. These two are at negative. You're Jeff? He's... This is Eric. I'm sorry, my fault, my fault, my fault. One more time, one more time. Let's run down the score real quick before... Let's run down the score real quick before we close the game out. Block error Jeopardy. Rory is at 1,100. Jeff is at 1,000. Eric is at negative 1,800. And Maul is at negative 2,200. I got it right. Oh, God damn it. This is hard work. You didn't get it right. This is hard work. I didn't tell you. Keep that. Keep that. Keep that. You're hustling, everybody. You got it wrong again. I got it wrong again. You got all right, the blog Eric Jeopardy scores goes Give as follows. in his cup. Rory at 1,100, Jeff at 1,000, Eric at negative 1,800, and Maul at negative 2,200. Yeah. Bring it home. You got me. Maul showed up. He got it wrong again. Me. How? He negative 2,000. No, I said 2,200. I know, that's wrong. Oh, it's 2,000. <laughs> and Rihanna was on that song. <laughs> All right. You've hosted this stage in front of 800 people. It's just Rosie. Just Rosie? Yeah. Okay. As we, all right, all right. I'm going to get it right. I'm going to get it right. As we close our blog, Era Jeopardy, let's run down the score. Rory is at 1,100. Yeah. Jeff is at 1,000. Yeah. Eric is at negative 1,800. Yeah. And Maul is at negative 2,000. Yeah. Do it, Maul! Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Here you work. go. Work. Pick let's, one, what you got? Let's do mixtapes for 400. Mixtapes for 400. What hot... <laughs> That's me. Let, this, this, Give it to Maul. Maul, he got it. He just, yeah, this... Oh. 
what high in calcium beverage is half the name of Wiz Khalifa's, Wiz Khalifa's 2010 mixtape? Orange. Finish it. Juice. Yeah, he's playing. <laughs> Last question, baby. All right, let's get it. Lyrics for 400. Finish that lyric. I don't love him. I don't chase him. Fuck. Just gonna win. I don't love him. I don't chase oh, him. Oh, yeah, he did. Hose? <laughs> <laughs> that yeah, was personal. That would be the <laughs> personal for him. I say no. I duck him. I duck him. Oh, that is yeah. Oh, it's mesmer oh, mesmerized. I duck him. <laughs> You're wrapping up blog era jeopardy right now, and uh, Rory looks like is the winner hey. of today's contest. Hey. Um, Rory, I'm, okay. I'm furious. <laughs> <laughs> Rory, do you have anything to say in regards to today's game? I mean, I've, I've been illegally downloading for years to get to this place. Yes. My computer has every virus you could think of <laughs> for me to get here today yes. to win this Jeopardy. Mm -hmm. So you can thank my hard drive on my Dell. And your for award for today is a $100 Karma Loop card. Oh, gosh. How much, gift card. Yeah. Uh, $100. How much diamond supply can I get with that? <laughs> yeah. Now, before... Now, before we get out of here, I want to run across the table real quick. What's your favorite blog era mixtape? I'm probably going to go Wale more about nothing. It's okay. my favorite blog era. Mixed Solid up. pick, Eric. I'm going to go Cushion OJ. Okay. Ma? Uh, Kendrick Section 80. Okay. And uh, Jeff? Rick Ross, Albert Anastasia. Ooh. Sleeper right there. What about you, Lowe? That's a quick one. Uh, I'm going with Dom Kennedy, the original Dom Kennedy. Man, one of my all. favorites. It's a great next day. So from Low Key, Eric, Jeff, Maul, Rory, the blog era Jeopardy game was a success. Yeah. Thank you very much for joining Listen, us. Man. If you're going to lose, lose big. Man. Lose big, baby. If you're going to lose, lose big. <laughs> Till next time, cheers. Go lose or go home. <laughs> the blog era, the podcast, is available streaming everywhere. We've taken three years to two build this epic story. We talk to 150 people. We have 500 hours of original recordings. This thing is more than a podcast. It's a movie. It is the story, truly, of the American dream, both achieved and taken. Um, this is a, a masterpiece that we've been working on. We're super excited for everyone to hear it. Everybody who lived it, everybody who was curious about it, everybody who doesn't even know it. Yeah. We're super excited about it. Let's this. go subscribe, like, comment. Below. I haven't put Jordans on in, in maybe seven or eight years. I mean, you got and I forgot scared. how uncomfortable they <laughs> fucking are. You haven't worn Jordans in seven years? Yeah, Probably, you the, yeah. Got the skinny jeans, got the, the snap. Yes, yeah, I so. found the most acid wash tight jeans yeah. I could find. Yeah, you, 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 yeah, fit check is pretty well. lot. Ten deep. Look at the amount of collabs. Rare fashion. One of one. There's definitely more than one of these t-shirts. <laughs> <laughs> and I think we got, you know, the guys over here. Well, that's, that's well you got the, the... I got the DMG. Yep. Yeah. I got Fool's Gold. Right. I got the WeSC. Mm -hmm. I got the uh, 2008 Nikes. Okay. I'm out here. All right. All right. I think, I think it's, yeah, it's a regular, a regular fit. Yeah, 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 yeah. You took it to the, to the next level. Had to. Yes. Okay. So this is, from, this is from Great Britain, right? Just Hype, 2011. You got the Goodwood oh, custom pieces. Goodwood. I okay. couldn't find my rosary of uh, beads <laughs> that I used to wear. The Goodwood is crazy. It's though. crazy. Goodwood is sick. That's, that's, that's like all the way that's the, time. that's the essential yeah. piece to the block. Crazy. Yeah. Yeah. The Carhartt camos and yeah. the best album of the blog era, Watch the Throne. Wow. LeBron's. All I had was a Tisa hat. <laughs> the two, super five. It that comes in. Yeah, that's good though. But, that was it. I don't know, the rugby shit was I'm kind of during, yeah, yeah. during the, no, the blog era shit. In any era. The Jordan 11s, I mean, yeah. that's, you know, every era, but yeah, I thought the Tisa was like a standout. Yeah. That's yeah. something that, that's very particular. To yeah, absolutely. Blogger. I just got to, you know, this cargo pants, fucking Air Force Ones. The low uniform. Low, yeah, it's like the low was, uniform. Yeah. I, like I, I have a blog every day. Yeah. <laughs> More than James. Low looks like he was at SOB's like last night. Last night. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Yo, SOB's, by the way, super important to the blog era, right? It's I'm the most important. Thrilled that you guys like suggested this because mm. like without SOB's, you don't get like Charles Hamilton shows, two change so Man, shows. Charles Hamilton, that's a crazy. Yo, Six Drake Six show when he was here. Yeah. Yeah. Slaughterhouse, crazy. Uh, Kendrick Lamar. I was there when Lowe hosted Kendrick's first show. Mm -hmm. And we were talking before he came, well, me, Jeff, and Eric, and Lowe were there when Sirius Jones battled Charles Hamilton and then a young K Dot stepped in and battled him at SOBs. You can see Class. dumbass Rory behind Sirius Jones, <laughs> 18 years old, yeah. like. <laughs> 
See, I didn't know the dumbass story was there. <laughs> nah, Rory was Rory was everywhere. Like during the BET days, my blog days, I saw Rory amongst a lot of strong, strong individuals. In Under twenty one, getting into all the yeah, twenty one spots, causing havoc. So yeah, Rory is a <laughs> run around intricate, <laughs> intricate part of the blogger. Here's like, how authentic these guys have committed themselves to this SOBs event is that just like in the blog era at SOBs, all dudes, they're all dudes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think a woman's ever been to SOBs. Right. <laughs> SOBs is a scaring a whole thing. That's what the, the whole thing. It was def about. definitely dudes in here just shoulder to shoulder going like, yo, did you see Scott on how to make it in America last yeah, night? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like who's Scott? Oh, uh, Cuddy, sorry. Yeah. I, call, I call him Scott. I call him Scott. Yeah, I call him Scott. <laughs> and so. What were some of your favorite Twitter DMs? I think Rick Ross DMing you might have been one of my favorite. Um, it was, that was during the mixtape. Yeah. Uh, he called you Beyonce, I believe. He called me a Beyonce ass nigga because I gave props to his Rich Forever album <laughs> saying it should be an album. And I was listening to Beyonce a couple days before, so I guess he saw my tweets and said, you're not a street nigga, you're a Beyonce ass nigga. And that's not a bad compliment to have because I do love Beyonce. <laughs> look, at, look, at, look at the balance, that's <laughs> hilarious. Yo, you're not a street no. nigga because you listen to Beyonce. <laughs> but no, right, all right. Let's talk about Rich Forever. Right, let's let's put this all into perspective, right? The blog era, let's say 2007 to 2012, those are the peak years. This time was like all about you have the gatekeepers, MTV, Double XL, Hot 97. Everyone knows how to operate within that structure. And then all of a sudden you have guys like Low Key and SK from Not Right and Misinfo and Two Dope Boys and On Smash and all these websites that are just not following the rules. They're going outside of the, the gatekeepers, right? And they automatically become hey, hey, hey. the new gatekeepers because they're cooler. And so artists man. like Wiz right. Khalifa yeah. and Currency wow. and Mickey Thax and Dom Kennedy, Dom Kennedy yeah, Charles course. Hamilton <laughs> and Kid Cudi and all like these people who intro. never would have gotten yeah. a shot otherwise, well, Nicki yeah. Minaj, uh, yeah. Mac yeah. Miller, all these people who were outside of regular big buildings get a shot. They get to come here, they get to prove their worth and all of a sudden they get an audience and all those stars, the crazy thing is that it's like 15 years ago, but they're all running shit today. Yeah. Drake, sure. it's crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, so what you guys are putting out, is, is it called a podcast per se? Yeah, this thing yeah but out? like this shit is a movie. Like it is, it is, it's three years in the making. We spoke to 150 people. Which we is did. like even still just a drop in the bucket. Yeah. But like it is like, you know, we, we tried to cover, uh, we tried to be more evocative than representative. Yeah. And so it's, it is a podcast. It's a 10 part series, but we're rolling it out like it's prestige television like this is something that like you could take and digest and listen to again and we're soundtracking it like it's a movie and we're like presenting it like it's a movie because like these people who you think are just anonymous random people behind keyboards are actually superstars and the work that they did changed the course of pop culture absolutely you don't get drake without not right absolutely not. and so we wanted to put that for every drake and Wiz and cuddy we wanted to give you an sk a low-key a hoff People who don't get the recognition and really give them their flowers in a really dynamic way. Well, I think blogs started direct to consumer, even if it wasn't monetized at the time at all. Yeah, yeah. It showed the process that you go direct to consumer, and the majors aren't really needed. Nor is well, having to go to like, MTV to do a press run. Yeah. yeah, there's more people under these comments right here than are actually gonna go buy my shit if I'm on 106 and Park. Yeah, yeah. It. I think it saved hip hop, the blog era. I yep. think it saved hip hop's business. Yeah. I don't even know if you get streaming the exact same way without blogs. I think yeah. blogs percent. have legitimately saved hip hop and made it the oh, business yeah, and genre it is today. So yeah. I'm yeah. so happy you guys are telling us. Oh, thank, thank you. you. And you guys of all people, because you were there <laughs> yeah, and yeah, really yeah, get it. Yeah, like, been there, yo, everywhere. Like you couldn't go anywhere and not <laughs> see you guys. Like, well, so. that means a lot to us because yeah. like, Given that time, a lot of people could just stay behind their keyboards, yeah. you know? Yeah. That, like when people say it's the Wild Wild West, it was the Wild Wild West because people like Byron Crawford or like, you know, other people just sat at home, threw shots out there, knew they would get a response and that was fine. Yeah. But like, if we're going to make a sketch video and we're going to like, you know, say something about Lloyd Banks or yeah, whoever else. We know. Which I'll never forget you guys for. We yeah. will be outside and we will see him. Yeah. yeah. And, and that's the respect that we earned in that time too. By the way, I can just say, you're making very salient points. Yeah. It's so hard to take you seriously know, while you're yeah. wearing <laughs> yeah. this. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I've just been trying to look in the yeah. eyes. That's you want to know, you want to know <laughs> the best part? So we took the subway down here and so many people were like, yo, it's great top. And they're yeah. just like, yo, is that like, is that the Beastie Boys chain? And I'm just like, the best answer is just like, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Whatever. Yeah. See, that's different because I would have saw you on a train. I would have told you, welcome home. <laughs> <laughs>
hundred percent. Seth Maul was, you know, from the Rockefeller era. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How many points do we think he's going to get in this this Jeopardy? Did you this have a blog. computer during 2007, 2012? You had a or? Dell. <laughs> yes, I had a computer. I definitely had a laptop. But um, it's interesting because it's, it's you know you, so much shit has happened, so you forget a lot. Yeah. Right? So it's gonna be interesting to see how much I can actually remember. Though. Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah, I know no lyrics. So like, let's just like oh god, yeah. The yeah, lyric yeah, category. Yeah, I, yeah. Lyric. Yeah. yeah. I'm hoping it's very simple. Like. What was the other color Wiz said? Black? <laughs> yeah. Yellow! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't ask me no lyrics. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Right, let's go.